Alright, what's up people? You know who it is. It's your boy Hustle88. Welcome to the channel. This is my second video. If you haven't seen my first video, I suggest for you to watch it. I suggest for you to share it to your friends, family, whoever you are. But right now, let's talk about E3. Why I do not like people, you know, posting, you know, information about games rumors and speculations about E3 what games is coming out and I really don't like that because it ruins the whole entire you know experience because when you ruin the whole entire experience it's like you spoil the cake it's like you ruin everything it's like you're ruining like the whole entire set when you do that and I do not like that and I want something, I want to, like, when I watch a conference, E3, I want to experience something that I never even experienced before, a game that's coming out. Um, a long time ago, they used to have GT, I'm not GT, but um, G4 TV. Um, G4 TV came on um, DirecTV. If you had DirecTV, or you had Satellite, or you had uh, Comcast. I don't know if Comcast had it back then, but, you know, they had G4 TV. And I used to watch that all the time. I used to watch G4 TV every day. After I came from school, they used to like show like X Play. I mean the whole nine. Then they had the conference, E3 conference. And when I saw the E3 conference, I was really blown away because you know back then I didn't have the internet. But you know now since I have the internet, it's like everything has been spoiled now. It's like information is just right in front of you on a computer set i mean i just don't like that because it ruins a whole entire fun like it ruins a whole entire you know experience where you want to be able to like see for yourself what it's like what games is coming out and i know for a fact they're going to show a lot of great games you want to see uncharted 4 i know they're going to show uncharted 4. um sadly the news that came out you know Thank God they have the collection, but I feel like no multiplayer, I feel like that's not worth 60 bucks because, you know, after you play the single player, it's like, what's next? You know what I'm saying? You see what I'm getting at? It's like, what's next after that? But, um, yeah, just tell me what you think about this video. Leave your thoughts, comments, like, subscribe. Um, tell a friend, tell a friend, share it to your family. And personally, I don't like spoilers at all. I don't like speculations about Games that's coming out at E3 because it ruins the whole entire experience at all. I do not like that at all, period. But um, comment below and tell me what your thoughts about E3. Um, just tell me what you think about the speculations that's coming out. Now you got Gears of Wars and then you got all these games, Doom, um, a list of games that's coming out. But at the same time, it's like, it's just speculation that's coming out. And I do not like that, but just subscribe to this channel if you can. And I'm out. Deuces, peace. Salute. God bless.